guys hi so I got some uh, stuff in the mail today went and picked it up I'm really excited because this is something uh, that I wanted to do for my own uh, personal uh, security um, so that I wasn't I wouldn't worry about it because I'm always worrying about the security uh, as far as my my uh, Ledger Blue, uh, I'm always worried about the the uh, seed key. Uh, you know, I've got it written down, but uh, writing it down just ain't good enough. What if the uh, what if the place catches on fire? What if there's a flood? Um, you know, I there's a lot of things like that can happen. If that happens, then um, you know, if if it floods and or catches on fire, you know, floods it'll it'll wipe it out if it catches on fire um, you know it'll burn up plus I'm I you know I got my nano I mean my blue sorry uh, in the same place so if I get a fire it'll burn up not only my seed key but my blue and I'm screwed you know so uh, a few days back uh, I ordered this and there'll be a link in the description uh, I ordered a quarter inch stainless steel plate, so a fire ain't gonna affect that. Flooding ain't gonna affect that. Nothing, you know. That's that's tough. It cost me four dollars and fifty cents. Okay, plus uh, six dollars and eighty-eight cents shipping. So let's go take a look at it, and I'll show you what I'm gonna do. So here it is. I haven't even opened it yet. So let's. Uh, oh yeah perfect right there and I kind of uh, I calculated it out you know the size that I needed uh, to put my I have 24 words for my seed key so I'm going to put them in this way and I can fit 12 right here and I can flip it over and I can fit 12 more and the way I'm going to do it is uh, I have these stamps right here I'm gonna use these I, I calculated it out for the eighth inch letters but I do have some some quarter but I'm missing one I'm missing the letter B so that's B for bummer anyway so I got this wood so I'm gonna I'm gonna place this on here I'm going to mark it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And stamp in each word for my seed key. I'm putting it on this because I don't want to scratch the other side while I'm hammering it down. You know, i got this hammer here. Um, you could probably use a smaller, regular hammer. But I don't want to get it all really boogered up. But anyway, I can take this. Heck, I could bury it out here in the yard somewhere, you know. Uh, that's a pretty good idea. I, never, I hadn't thought of that, but that'd be, that'd be pretty good. Bury it out here in the yard. And uh, that's kind of funny, you know. Everyone used to bury their, uh, their cash in uh, coffee cans in their yard. So I'm kind of like uh, carrying on a, a time-old tradition if I do that, huh? So... That's what I'm doing with this right here. And uh, what I wanted to extend to you guys is uh, I'm going to figure out, you know, kind of like a flat rate, how, how much it costs to ship this out. And I'll figure out how I can ship this stamp set to you guys. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll figure something out to where you can send me a... I'll set up a wallet that you can send me BTC, you know, like I'm thinking like $10 worth to cover my shipping to you. I'll ship this to, to you. Uh, you can use it to do and do your own thing. I'll give you a link for this right here to, to buy this from the guy on, on eBay. And uh, you'll have to provide your own hammer. But you'll be able to uh, stamp out your own seed key 
in a way that uh, you're not going to have to worry about it being destroyed. So, and you can bury it in your yard. I, I you know, I just thought that. I like that idea. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. So, um, I will do an update video to it about, uh, uh, once I figure out prices on sending this out, how much it's going to cost me, um, so you guys can use it. I will not make your seed key. Don't even ask. I, d I don't want nothing to do with your seed key at all. You guys take care of that. I don't want to be responsible. I've, if something happens, I don't want you guys saying, oh, he stole my seed key. So this way, it's completely secure. Uh, you know, you guys stamp it out. I have no idea which stamps you used, what you put down. Send it back to me, and then the next person gets to use it. Um, I think that's a pretty cool setup uh, for everyone. So, and uh, also, you know, a lot of wallets, like your... Uh, your uh, Jack's wallet, you know, has a master seed key. You can do the, do the same thing. It's the exact same principle. If you have a... I'm doing it for my Ledger Blue. Um, I'm going to do it for a few other of my wallets. But uh, if you have, like, a keep key, you're going to have a master seed key. You're, if you do it for a uh, Tracer, you're going to have a seed key. So, um, yeah. That's it. So... That's that's what my plan is. Uh, leave a comment. Uh, if you guys are interested in doing this, um, you know, using this and making your own, that's awesome. If you live outside of the United States, um, you know, you may, I mean, I'm not unwilling to ship it to you, but it's going to cost a lot more just for the simple fact it's going to cost more money for me to ship it. And uh, you may want to look at getting a set of these, you know, they're just... Uh, uh, machine made letters and figures steel stamps so all oh, these are three sixteenths of an inch and then these are uh, eighth so there you go uh, leave a comment tell me what you guys think of my idea